First Chronicles. It's a book of, of record. It's a book of record. 28. Chronica Chamatomo. 28. First Chronicles. If we read there, First Chronicles, we read verse 9 to 11. 28 and verse 9. Chapter 28, verse 11. 9, verse 9 to 11. To 11. Are you there? And thou, Solomon, my son, know thou the God of thy father, and serve him with a perfect heart Amen. and with a willing mind. For the Lord searches all hearts and understandeth all the imagination of the thoughts. If thou seek him, he will, he will be found of thee. But if thou forsake him, he will cast thee off forever. O me arogo Solomon wena wanaka utlompe modimo wa tatao me o mo direle ka pelo ya ga o ka moka le ka mafulufulo. Morena o lukishitse se se le go ka dipelong tsa batho ka moka. Home o tsebe me gopolo yotlhe ge o ka ya go yena o tla o amogela e utswa ge o ka motlogela o tla go lahlela sa rori I want to read 10 and 11 don't read mama take heed Amen. now for the Lord hath chosen thee to build in a house for the sanctuary be strong and do it <coughs> then David gave to Solomon his son the pattern of the porch and of the houses thereof, and of the treasures thereof. Can you see the, the verse there, we are, where we are reading? Let's pray. Father, thank you for your word, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Today, I want us to talk about God's plan. God's plan is our plan. You know, when I was reading here, I found that this was God's plan to David. And when God brought that plan, he showed him everything that must be done. He showed that this is the house you need to build. And this is the plan and a plan that I'm having that you can execute. And if you can read 19 and 21 to 21 for the same chapter, can you just go down there? You'll be surprised that David says, All this said, David, the Lord made me understand in writing by his hand upon me. Amen. Even all the works of this pattern. Amen. And David said to Solomon his son, Be strong and of good courage, and do it, fear not, nor be dismayed. For the Lord God, for the Lord God, even my God, even my God will be with thee. He will not fail thee, nor forsake thee, until thou hast finished all the work for the service of the Lord, of, of, the, of the house of the Lord. And 21, and behold, the causes of the priest and the levers, even they that shall be thee. If you can read, just read 21 for me. Paling 21. He says what? Ba priest and levers live in Philemitiro. Yavaswani, yavaswani chio. Oi tira katem peling. Vashumi. Ba ba kona gomitiro kamoka ba fish chio. O tusha. O meva tu kamoka leba eta pele. Can you see that verse there? That verse shows that the plan of God will come to pass in the life of Solomon. Because no one will defy the plan. 
I've read this, I found that when God brings his plan, it really affects us. We tend to do the way God wants us to do. And there are some people he bring them to us. So that we do exactly what God wants us to do. Listen to this. I found that if God is in the plan, and he brought you to the plan, Sometimes you won't even understand that the plan is bringing to you. You'll be able to handle it. And the same God who brought the plan to David. He was able to tell David that David, this time, I'm disapproving you on this plan. Your son will carry it out. When I read that, I found that God's plan, though he gave to you, he can even check you again and disapprove you tomorrow. Many of us, we are in God's plan, but when we fail God, he chose someone. Because he wanted his plan not to fail. If you can read there, he had a plan of his house, but he doesn't want anybody to fail. And once somebody fails, he appointed another one. Not long I found that we are created to execute his plan. Place. If you are around on earth, you are here because of God's plan. Whatever you might be thinking, that's why the Bible says, lean not on your own understanding. Because God wants you to do it the way He wants you to do it. Many of us already we are asking why we are facing what we are facing. We don't know that you are in the plan of God. And Already God knows what you want to achieve on what you are facing. The Bible says in Psalm 119, verse 123, Solomon was told by his father, on this plan, be strong. Because this is the plan that God wants to do. And you are determined by the plan. And you have to fulfill this plan. Because you are chosen to carry it out. Hallelujah. Amen. As I say, my friend. Though you have been given assignment. God is checking if you will make that level. If not, God can still choose someone. Listen to this. I found that in every plan that God gives you, it ranges your life. If God wants you to live to live long. He give you longer plans. Listen, if your plans on earth are finished, it's useless for you to live on earth. If God brought you here and gave you plans or you are plan, not aware of his plan. I want you to know this. The reason why you are still alive is because God is still having plans about you. There are plans that he is giving you. There are plans that really they are hidden from your eyes, from your understanding. The reason why you are alive is because of those plans.
Right now you are in the plan of God. You, 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 might, you might be suffering. But, but you are in the plan of God. You, you might be lacking, but you are in the plan of God. Whatever you are facing, if you are in the Lord, this is the plan of God. Are you hearing me? This is the plan of God for your life. Hallelujah. Amen. If you read Proverbs 19, verse 21. The Bible says many are the plans in men's minds. But it's the Lord's purpose for him that will stand. It's the Lord that decides. Many are plans in the mind of men. But God brings out a purpose. Whatever you are planning, when you fail, don't say you have failed. Say, this is not the purpose of God. It means there's still something you need to do. Some of you, you are failing on what you are doing. And you are beginning to write yourself off. But I want to tell you there's a plan of God upon your life. You have not yet failed. You are, you are in the plan of God. I don't, I don't know if you are hearing me. Check somebody say, my friend. You might be having many plans. The one you will carry out is the purpose of God for you. God doesn't want Christians to fail. God doesn't want you to be busy with something that he has not assigned you for. When I was reading here, I read Genesis 11. Genesis 4 and 5 there. You find that these people had their own together. And they build, they have got one language together. But always when you do something big, God comes and search if it really is in my plan. And the Bible says, God descend to check. He found that they were contrary to the scriptures. Listen to this. If your plans makes you to go away from the word of God, that plans will bring a curse. Because God wants you to be fulfilled. many of you, you don't know why you are here today. I'm here to tell you that you are not created to fail. You are not created to be stagnant. You might be in a wrong way. But God wants to make sure that you are going to carry out his plan. Some of you are not even in the plan of God. You might be looking like you are failing, but you are not failing. You might be looking like you are struggling, but you are not struggling. When the plan of God becomes visible, everybody will praise God. Everybody will worship God around him. The Bible says God decided. He, checked, he found that they agreed outside of his plan. And he scattered them. Listen to this. This year, whoever agreed to be against you. God will scatter him. There, there might be many be in the plan of God when people are against you. They will be against the plan of God upon your life and God will scatter them. When I read this, I found that every plan goes plan by his purposes. There is something that God needs to achieve. Thank God I'm here today. And thank God you are here today. There is something that God wants you to achieve. Or you want to achieve through your life. Sometimes you look at yourself you find a, a road is cul-de-sec. And God wants to make a road where there is no road because you want to achieve a road where there is no road. Your life sometimes when you look at it, 
How you don't understand it. But there's a purpose of the God. And there's something that God wants to achieve by what you are facing. Tell your neighbor, say, my friend. Now I don't mind about what I'm facing. Because my God is going to be my God. Will make sure that whatever I'm facing will fall, and I will reach a plan of God upon my life. I found that always in God's plan, which is our plan, we are not failures. Hallelujah! In Proverbs 12, verse 2, a good man obtain favor from the Lord. But a man of wicked devices, he will condemn. A device is a plan. Device is a plan. A good man obtain favor from the Lord. But there's a man of wicked devices, wicked plans. Amen. That man, God will condemn. We are judged by our plans. Tell him, you are judged by your plans. Can I tell you this? I, I was learning this. I found that sometimes when you are trying to strategizing, achieving what you want to achieve, you just look on what you have achieved. But you don't look when God, where God is looking. God look at the way you went there. You look where you are standing. He, he looks at your strategy. Some of you, you are busy with wrong strategies. As long as you achieve what you want to achieve. God looks at your plans. How you move here, how, what you have done here. He, looked, he doesn't look at the reason. This world well, Define you by the reasons. God will judge you because of what you are trying to apply here to reach a level. Listen, it's better you become good. It's better you look failure or it becomes hard than to attain things in a wrong way. Because God is looking on your formulas. He's not looking at your answers. He gives you favor because of how you are doing Things. People will just praise you when they are looking at the end. But God will be busy looking on how you achieve those things. Many of us today, we are trying to get what we can get, but we don't know God's plan. If we believe God by seeking His kingdom, and we live right, God will give us favor. Otherwise, we will be condemned. One time I was telling somebody, I said, in life, people spend time working very hard. And after they work so hard, they attain money. And they get the money now for but their health. Because when they were busy here, they, they could, could not check, check that what they were doing. They were, they were creating formulas that were create, destroy them. Many times people are trying to get money. But how they get money is what God is looking. Because God looks at the place. He looks at your billboard. He doesn't look at the finished and he look when you start the foundation. He looks when you are building. And when the wind comes, as you are still lacking cement, and watch, you find the wind will blow and the house will fall. There are some people here you are trying to do things right way. This week, 
favor of God will follow you. Say I'm in his God's plan. I don't mind what I'm facing. I'm in his God's plan. When I'm waiting, I'm in his God's plan. When it's tough, I'm in his God's plan. God's plan is my plan. I don't mind what is happening around me. I can be overtaken, but I don't mind. I can be overtaken, but I don't mind. I can be rejected, but I don't mind. I'm in God's plan. As I'm in God's plan, God's plan will be visible in my life. Can I prophesy you? There are some people who are here. You have been rejected, facing troubles. People will see the plan of God upon your life this day. I said they will see the plan of God upon your life. Right now they are leaving you because it's tough. They don't understand you because whatever you are facing, nobody can solve it. But there's God's plan in your life. I see you as a leader. I see you as the first person who will be better than them. That's what I said this year in a year of fulfillment the plan of God will be my plan. If you read Psalm 33 verse 11, the Lord brings the counsel of the wicked to naught and make the devices of the people of none effect. The Lord in Psalm 33 verse 11, verse 11, he said, the Lord brings the counsel of the wicked Amen. to not. I read it. I found that it has happened. If you read Esther, Esther, 5, Esther 5, verse 10 to 14, verse 10 to 14, we found Haman and his friends when they come together in chapter 5, they, chapter 5. they advise Haman and they say, Haman, because Mordecai doesn't want to bow in front of you. Make a gallow to hang him. In chapter 6, we found Haman coming back crying. Because always he thought everything was working for him. Whereas it was working for the person he didn't want. And the Bible says when Haman came back his hands were on top of his head. And he was crying. Because the person he didn't want was the one that was raised by king. And the moment he reaches there, his wife and his friends who advise him to make a gallop to kill Mordecai. They are the same people who are saying if Mordecai is a Jew and you have fallen like this time, this time you will never rise again in front of you. Listen to this. When I was reading that I began to say the Cancel of the wicked will become to naught. There are some people this year they've put a trap in your life. But I'm here to tell you the cancel of the wicked. The cancel of the wicked will come to zero. That's what I say, my friend. My plans will be God's plans. This year is my year. But the cancel of the weekend will come to no effect. I want to prophesy someone. As you are a Christian, you are serving Jehovah. Those who are starting canceling, those who are creating stories against your life, they will fall this year.
I said they will fall this year. Because God is on your side. Where they try to trap you. Where you are working. They will get the same trap. Where they are trying to stop you. In your progress. They will get the same, the same stop. Stop it. Where they are trying to fight you. To defeat you. They are going to be defeated. The Bible says. They will come to you. One way. But they will run. Seven ways. Let them come together. Shine your shine. In front of them. Because this year. Whatever they come together. Against your life. They will scatter. I said they will scatter. I said they will scatter. There are some people here who don't understand the plan of God. You are just looking at the people who are against you. Listen, such people they are searching for a testimony. When they are against you, don't fight them. Leave them aside. Look unto God. Look unto Jesus. The author. The and the finisher of your faith. He will never leave you. I see some people here. Life is tough right now. But I'm telling you. This year. There is God's plan. In your life. You will never fail. Check somebody and say, hey, I see God's plan in my life. Don't laugh at me. When I'm down, there is God's plan in my life. Don't joke about me. When it's tough, there is a God's plan in my life. Don't criticize me. There is God's plan in my life. Can you shake somebody up? My God is giving me a plan. And this plan is of this year. When I read scriptures, I found God's plan. But the time of Hezekiah. And the Bible says they were supposed to build. And when they're supposed to build, and Hezekiah, who was a king, started to be sick. When he was sick, and there was a plan of God. And the God says, He faced the wall. But the prophet says, The plan of God for you is for you to be buried. And when he faced the wall, God says, Now I am changing the plan. I'm changing the plan. I'm changing the plan. I will never allow you to be buried. And Hezekiah rose up to praise God and said the, the grave cannot praise you because your plan is successful and I can praise you because you have done something so I can praise you listen to this there was a plan in the life of Jesus the Bible says he was led to be tempted he was led to fast he never decided to fast he was led to fast when he was led to fast he could not feel hungry it's only when he finished the fasting Satan came and tried to say I don't believe you are a child of God look at yourself you are smelling bad you are hungry if you are a child of God prove if you have received power change the stones and make them bread Jesus said I am not disparate 
Nakatiwa ni I know my God Nakia mutima mutimu waka I'm here Naki hona mo For the plan of God Kote la plan ya yo hoti I'm not here Naki mokyu To make food Ore kiti ya di isho I'm here Masu ike For my assignment Kalima kalari kina limu diro When devil went away Ah satana sipila The angel came Barunga bata And save him Batumu mutanke The plan of God began This year You look like shabby You look poor When devil is leaving you The plan of God In your life This year Will come to pass In the name of Jesus In the name of Jesus Shake somebody and say hey I look shabby I look like I'm smelling. I look shapeless. But there's a plan of God upon my life. I'm not looking back. I'm looking ahead. I'm not worrying about what I've been facing. I'm looking ahead. The plan of God upon my life will be carried out this year. And this year is my is my year of his plan. Shake somebody and say, hey, what are you expecting? What are you expecting? I'm hearing the plan of God. When somebody say, hey, look at your life, say, it is the plan of God. When somebody say, you are rejected, say, it's the plan of God. When somebody say, you can't get married, say, it's the plan of God. We need Christians who are saying, I need the plan of God. When people are fighting you, you are in the plan of God. Why? Because they are bound to see your God working mighty things in your life. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. I saw the plan of God. This year, I saw the plan of God. God told me whoever comes to church will be a symbol of a blessing. You know, you are going to break a curse and you become different to the family. Why? Because of the plan of God upon your life. You are going to be the head. You will never be the tail again. And whoever is against you will be ashamed because of the glory of God upon your life. There's a plan of God upon your life. Shake somebody. Hey, I feel it. Can you say I feel it? Because there are Christians who are here. They are asking God. They say their future. It looks gloomy. It looks like transparent. They can see what God is bringing. But I'm hearing that God say, Hey, children. Children, this year, this year, this year, is your year of my plan. Yeah, is my year. God's plan is my plan. Tell several people. God's plan is my plan. Hey, Ares, 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 Ares. Ares. Can I tell you something? I see someone in the family. Is rejected. She's rejected. But you will invite family in your waiting. It's your year. I say it's your year. They will begin to see a wedding because of you. I see someone. I see someone here. There's a plan of God here. In your life here. I'm seeing you. You are going to give them a close mouth up. Miracle. Why? Why? They were talking too much. They've been talking. Don't say be silent. 
be still and see it is your time to pass that river to pass that place check somebody and say hey this year I will shake them I in your life I'm seeing a business right now you don't have money there's a ghost plan in your life I'm seeing a limousine there's a ghost plan in your life I see my cities I see Range Rover I see I see Hey, let me talk in baby. These people will talk. Oh, they're just talking. About team. They don't know you. They're just talking. About team. They don't know who you are. Tell that person you don't know me. Hey, I won't see me. You are just talking, you know. You don't know me. Can I tell you? This year, wow. they will know you. Yeah, 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 but I'll see. Yeah. 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 Let me speak, baby. Kiribano Vulela Fela. They are just talking, oh. But about him. But they don't know who you are. But I remember Vulela. When they are still talking about you. What's your mm -hmm. name? And you appear. Hey. King Wawabo, no. This is their year. Well, faint. Oh, fainting. Oh, fainting. This is the year. Well, faint. Of fainting. Because of God's plan. In your life. I'm still God's plan now. In your life. Poverty is living. Rejection is dying. Success is your portion. They were just talking. Oh. Aris. Aris. Ah. Ah. Tell me. That is raising people here. And such people. You will see them flying. They are flying. Hey, they are leaving you. They are flying. They are flying. They are flying. Hey. Oh, we don't have scapsels in Charis. We've got Christians that fly. And you are flying. And flying. And where you are flying to? And you are flying to? If you are alone in the family who's going there. God's plan. In your life. 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 In your life.
I say God's plan in your life. I say in your life. I see power coming to you, brother. Take it, take it, take it. I say God's plan in your life. Yeah, yeah, take it, take it, take it. Receive power, receive power, you people. Take power, take it, take it. Take it. As a God's plan in your life, you people here. Take power, take power, you. Take power here. As a God's plan in your life, take power here. Take power. Take power. God's plan in your life. I said there's God's plan in your life. Take power. Take power. Take power. Take power. There's God's plan in your life. No one can temper with the plan of your life. No one will stop you this year. Say I'm unblockable. I'm unstoppable. This year is your year. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Lift up your hands. You know why you are here. God wants to restore you. There's a plan of God upon your life. I said there's a plan of God upon your life. This year, your parents will rejoice. Your siblings will understand. Your family will know. I said there's a plan of God upon your life. Can you lift up your hands? Begin to thank God for God's plan in your life. Thank God. Thank God. It is your time to thank God. It is your time. It is your time. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh. Can you thank God for the plan of God? Thank God. Oh. Can you thank God? In Jesus' name. Listen. Many of you, you were blocked by spirits of the family. They blocked your parents, your forefathers, but they can't block you. Amen. I say, listen, don't ever allow this mind of saying, my sister is like this. That's why I'm like this. It's a fallacy. It's, a, it's just a fallacy. What you need to tell yourself. The Bible says, when you have God, you are a new creature. Whatever you are facing, it's not what your brother was facing. It's not what your sister is facing. It's just bringing a testimony. It's a plan of God to bring a testimony. Can I tell you something? Some plans of the God. We won't understand it. One time when I was looking at the life of Joseph, I began to say, if it was me, even if God was telling me, this is my plan, I will disagree. But look what happened. 
Even today, because he agreed on the plan of God, we are still talking about him. He is still alive even today. He's in the Bible. Can I tell you this? Check what will happen. The plan of God that is coming up today is going to be to create a history in your lineage, in your family. Your children's children's children will talk about you. I said they will talk about you. Because that plan will make you to live your life. Can you lift your hands for the last time? If there is any demon, that has blocked the plan of God in your life. That demon now of the family or from the witchcraft or wherever in a witchcraft covenant. That demon is exposed right now. Father, can you show me such people? They were in the plan of God, but another one is running away. Ashes. There are many. I want to see them. There are so many. The spirits of the family. There are spirits that are blocking the plan of God upon your life. Holy Ghost, search right now. Amen. Search, search, search that problem. Search that situation. Search that tough times. Search, search. 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 Thank you. Search. 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 Any failure caused by any spirit. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Search. Watch, watch what God is doing. Some of you, you were supposed to be leaders by now. But you were blocked. Some of your plans, they are stolen. But today, it is your day. It is your day. Holy Ghost said, Search. There are many, there are many. Some of you are failing in business and you don't know why you are failing. Eh? Don't, don't leave that business. business. Don't leave that business. That business. You, are you. you are in the plan of God. You are in the plan of God. This year, that business. Wow, business are you? That, look, look at the lady. My God, my God, my God, my God. That business. Business are you? That business, business will be fulfilled this year. Father, can you show me? There are many, there are Amen. many. Others are planning to buy a house. Buy a car. Build a house at home. God is tough. It is a plan of God for you. You won't fail. Watch, 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 watch. That is disturbing the plan of God. It's located by fire. It's located by fire. It's located by fire. Whatever, whatever, whatever. It's located. It's located. It's located. It's located. Is located. Is located.
you want a child and there was a delay I'm telling you that child is coming by the plan of God you want to do business or you want to marry you want to you have got a plan but you are doubting because of what you are facing God say I must tell you that plan don't leave it this year you will see it coming to pass you will see it coming to pass in your life in your life in your life in your life, in your life, in your life. I see people they've got plan this year to marry or to get married they want to break a record Holy Ghost locate them Amen. locate them Holy Ghost locate them you have got a plan to start a family this but things are tough you are being located you have been located you will never fail you will never fail you will never fail you have got a plan to change a job to go and work somewhere I'm telling you it is your time Take your job. Take your job. Take your job. Take your job. As you are receiving a job, you are receiving a house. You are receiving your life. Take it. 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 Can you mention what you are taking? Mention what you are taking. Mention what you are taking. Let me hear. Bring the mic here. Who ring? I can't hear you. Why do I can't hear you? Why do I can't hear you? Why do I can't hear you? Yo, what is it that you want it to happen in his life? Why do you want these people to prosper in life? I just want him to suffer. So, so being as the mother, I want a wife that I will choose. Can you hear that? Hey, hey, stop, talk. You, you say what? Consider wife. Come, sir, I. I don't want the wife that is staying with because this my child has got a bright future can you hear that? you know what that wife is is the me. wife here it's boring me is the wife here or maybe she's down here can we bring his face on camera? Is the wife of this man here? Because you can hear that. So you don't want his wife. So What is the reason? Butata. I want I she made me to be you, 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 you chose you chose the wife. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I want to choose yeah. me the mother I want to choose for him a wife I want to give him a wife that I want so you can hear some of you you never lived your wife your life you live the life of your parents and is it God's plan you can hear them. you can hear what is happening to the brother here they say no you chose the wrong wife I'm the mother. You can hear I'm the mother. I want another wife. Not, oh, oh, one This one is making this, me bored. This is the language you are hearing. One silica. It's boring me. Can I tell you this? Today, your life is restored. I say you will live your life. Say I will live my life. I will live my life. And I will never fail. And I will never fail. 
Some of you were living wrong life. Friends are the one who are making you to live that life. But can I tell you today? What has been lost from you is found right now. I say it is found. Receive it. Can you receive the grace right now? Receive what you are here for. You are blessed. Clap as for yourself. There are some people here today that God is restructuring their lives. Because where you are staying is not where God wanted you to stay. Even where, I mean, whatever you have is not yours. But, eh? It's not yours. You must never deliver this one. We want to kill her. Why are you healing the heart? Whom are you speaking with? We are speaking to you. We are speaking with you. Why are you delivering it? We say this one must die. Who are you speaking with? We won't speak. We won't speak. Don't speak again. You must never call me you again. I will cut your heart, your head off. This one will not kill. Then it will cut your heart. Amen. It's over. It's over. It's over. There are some people here. We never had to mock him. That you know, you were supposed to be far by now. The little job I left, I left. You know, you were up. You came down. The little job I left, I left. Up. Down. 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 You don't have breakthroughs. Today, as you are here, God says, don't forget this day. You are receiving breakthroughs. I say you are receiving breakthroughs. Amen. Can you stop complaining? Stop worrying. Receive your breakthrough. I say receive your breakthrough. I receive. There, there are some people who are complaining, worrying about their situation. I want to encourage you. Go and write what you want to see. Sister wearing blue, blue. You wearing blue, Ceci. You must stop worrying. Eh? You are complaining. Why we lie? Yes, man of God. So you are saying why there is a strong delay? Why one aluchi na ko delay? Yes, man of God. In your business. Yes, man of God. Yes, man of God. It's been six years that we've been applying for an arbitration case with Botswana, and we have been owed more than two point five million. Researcher recorded two point five. Ke ha le rio apply le dilo. Today is your day. Ili chachila le na le. Take it. Amen. Come on, demon. My brother, you, yes. Booty. You have been worried. You, yeah, we lie. You know, I will tell you. Yes. The devil wants to kill someone. Satan yes. That is why this issue of turning around. That is why yes. this one sick, that one oh, sick. It's true. Yes. Yes. So yes. don't worry, don't worry. Yes. You were telling me about someone in hospital. Yes, my brother. Huh? Yes, my brother did. It's your brother. You would, yes. But there is still issues here around because the devil wants to kill someone. Satan, you people, all of you are protected. Yes. Take the power, receive the power. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Uh, Bishop, one two. Bishop, one two. Yes, come. Come here. I have seen you yesterday. You must not worry. If God has called you, Amen. He will perfect the calling. Praise God, I accept it. Because you are very much confused, man. About the issue of your ministry. Because remember the dream of the whole Africa. Amen. 
And you are just in Botswana here. God wants to bless you. Receive anointing. Receive anointing. Amen. Take it. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. You are free. There is a lady there. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, one, two, three. 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 You have passed the lady. Let her look at me. This one. Here yeah, straight. One, two, three. The camera is on top of the head. Camera code you want to have on. When are you going back to Zimbabwe? I don't know. Eh? I get it. You must know God has covered you with the blood of Jesus. No one will be able to wish you. You are blessed. Let me touch your stomach. You are free. 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 So, what is your problem? Kuten. <laughs> you say what? Eh? I don't want to stand. So if you sit down, you are sitting for You know how do you do leching? Eh? I'll just stay here forever. <laughs> so you want to stay here forever? Eh? You're getting used to us. You're getting uh, used to us. Uh, what is the meaning of that? Erawering. What is the meaning? Of... You are just opening or unveiling things that have been hitting some other people's things. Please, don't take my time. This time for profits. You, you are defeated already. Why now? Say you truth, say care. Let me touch your head. Don't hold me. Don't hold me. 